Living with a host family gives you a completely different perspective. I think it brings you that kind of connection with the culture rather than just seeing a museum or um, going to work every day. It, it makes such a big difference. <laughs> It's been a little less than 10 years now that I've been hosting volunteers with my mom and my sisters. As a kid, it was really fun for me to have uh, all of these people around the world in the house. When the volunteer arrives, we try to make them feel like at home. We try to make them be part of our lives so that they, they feel comfortable in the new surroundings, in the new situation. And I remember when I got off the plane and we got to my homestay's house and uh, the first thing we did was sat down and had a cup of tea and you know I was jet lagged and exhausted but from that moment I started to develop this relationship with the family that I now have. I was nervous about moving with a host family. I'd been living on my own with a friend in London for a few years, so I'd been very independent. I didn't really know what to expect. But after the first month, I couldn't imagine moving out. I'm so comfortable here. I feel one of the family. I wanted to stay with the host family because uh, as anyone would be uh, when they first come here, I had no idea what to expect. And <laughs> I wanted somewhere to go like whenever I was not busy and I could either be alone or be socializing with the family. I have my own room, I have my own routines, I get up in the morning, I go to work, I go see my friends, I can come home and eat with them, I can eat without them if I want to. I have the opportunity to spend time with the family whenever I want to. And, um, you know, we go off and do things together, we stay here and do things. I would say it's definitely a good mix of personal space as well as integration with the family. Language has probably been the most difficult thing for me here, <laughs> but I, it helps me because they'll, they'll ask me questions and at least it gets me into the habit of saying, like, hi, how are you? It's amazing to see how the volunteers grow and change during their stay here, how in the beginning we point at things and teach them words in Armenian, and at the end of their stay we make conversations with them in Armenian, and also how they grow to understand the culture and the people here better. It's really a cultural exchange that you don't get um, just by living by yourself and I really value having had the, the homestay experience here. So what are you waiting for? What are you waiting for?